David Jones sings English folk songs. One was, I'm the ba man who broke the Bank of Monte Carlo, <laughs> and um, which was a great song too. Yeah. But this one's got a I great the chorus. Music for that. Yeah, you I do? Got, I do actually. Charles yeah. Conway. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now this one, um, here's the chorus, and I want you all to sing it. You know the thing about singing choruses, if you've got a beautiful voice, great way to praise the Lord for giving you a beautiful voice is to sing, you know? <laughs> If you haven't got a beautiful voice, it's a great way to get even. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, anyway, here's the chorus. Two lovely black eyes. Oh, what a surprise. Only for telling a man he was wrong, it was two lovely black eyes. You want to try that? Two lovely black eyes. Two, two lovely black eyes. Oh, what a surprise, only for telling a man he was wrong, it was two lovely black eyes. While walking so happy down Bethnal Green, me and my pals you might have seen, Tompkins and me with his girl between, oh, what a surprise. I praised the conservatives frank and free, but Tompkins got angry and speedily. All in a moment he handed to me two lovely black eyes, two lovely black eyes. Oh, what a surprise, only for telling a man he it was two lovely black eyes. The next time I argued, I thought it best to give the conservative side a rest. The merits of liberals I firmly pressed. Oh, what a surprise. The chap I had met was a Tory true. Nothing the liberals right could do. And this was my share of the argument too. Two lovely black eyes. Two, Two lovely black eyes. Oh, what a surprise. Only for telling a man he was wrong. It was two lovely black eyes. The moral of guest I can hardly doubt, never on politics rave or shout, <laughs> leave it to others to fight it out, if you would be wise. Tis better, far better alone to let others to fight it out, you bet, unless you're willing and longing to get Two lovely black eyes, two lovely black eyes. Oh, what a surprise, only for telling a man he was wrong. It was two lovely black eyes. That's that song, two lovely black eyes. Song, but it's, it's very lively, the tune, it's an old Irish tune. And the chorus to this one is, I'm the man, the very fat man, that waters the workers' beer. I'm the man, the very fat man, that waters the workers' beer. What do I care if it makes them ill or makes them terribly queer? I've a car, a yacht, and an aeroplane. I waters the workers' beer. When I waters the workers' beer, I puts in stricken in <laughs> some methylated spirits and a drop of paraffin. <laughs> but such a terrible drink could make them terribly queer. So I reach me hand for the water tap and I waters the workers' beer. I'm the man, the very fat man. I'm the, the man, man, the very fat man, man that waters the workers' beer. beer. I'm the man, the very fat man that waters the workers' beer. What do I care? What do I care if I make them ill and make them terribly queer? I've a car, a yacht, and an aeroplane, and I've water the workers' beer. A drop 
of good beer is good for a man when he's weary, tired and hot. Sometimes I take a drink myself from a very special lot. But a fat and healthy working class is the thing I mostly fear. So I reaches me hand for the water tap and I waters the worker's beer. Cause I'm the man, the very fat man that waters the worker's beer. I'm the man, the very fat man that waters the worker's beer. What do I care if I makes them ill and makes them terribly queer? I have a car, a yacht and an aeroplane and I water the worker's beer. Now there's another verse which I wrote down on a piece of paper. That's wrong piece of paper. Um, it's um, oh come, come, ladies fair, beyond from compare, whether being maid or wife. Oh, give a, sometimes give a thought to one who leads a wandering life, for the water rates are shockingly high and meth is shockingly dear. There isn't the profits there used to be in watering the workers' beer. Cause I'm the man, the very fat man that waters the workers' beer. I'm the man, the very fat man that waters the workers' beer. What do I care if it makes them ill and makes them terribly queer? I have a car, a yacht and an aeroplane and I waters the workers' beer. 1933, that song. Oh, Eric Bogle, he's a Scotsman who lives in Australia, has written many national songs now in Australia and um, the, the band played Waltz in Matilda and it's about when the soldiers go off to the wars to Gallipoli and the band is playing Waltz in Matilda as they go on the ship and then they get to Suvla Bay and mm -hmm. they get all massacred up and he gets his legs blown off and then they come back to Suvla Bay and the band is still playing Waltz in Matilda. But it's a, it's a heavy, beautiful song. I don't know whether this would be the right moment for it. <laughs> this is the right moment. But, um, I, I, I don't think so. It's, um, I'll sing you a verse, just show you, show you how it goes. When I was a young man, I carried me back. I led the free life of a rover. From the Morris Green Basin to the dusty outback, I waltzed my Matilda all over. Then da, 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 the country said, son, it's time to stop your rambling, there's work to be done. So they gave me a tin hat and they gave me a gun and they sent me away to the wars. And the band played waltzing Matilda as we pulled away from the key. No, amid all the tears, Flag waving and tears, they sent us to Gallipoli. So I really have to, I'll be stumbling all the way through. That's this. okay, keep stumbling, we're enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> Stumble some right. more. That's a good song to do if we lose the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come here. We'll look forward to it. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, loser songs. <laughs> Let me just sing uh, this one, we join in this one. It, it's called I'm a Lucky Man, you know, because in, in, in a way we're all lucky. You know, we, we're not living in, um, where's that place in the Sudan? With all the problems, here we are in the Arbor. Leone is not so bad, is he? So, um, and this is written by a Canadian guy. Um, Getting there. <laughs> named Rick Laskin, who uh, builds beautiful guitars. And that's, uh, the chorus is, I am a lucky man, favoured by good fortunes, and far more than I'm deserving. That's the chorus. Um, I had no say in being born, or where and when it happened to me. It was only chance that turned the wheel and made my living easy. Oh, I am a lucky man, favoured by good fortunes, and far more than I'm deserving. I've had good work since I was young, mastered a trade, my business thriving. But there are those who want for work, no job means no surviving. For I am a lucky man, 
favored by good fortune's hand, far more than I'm deserving. I have a love that's fair and true, a marriage have I that's rich with pleasure. But there are those whose marriage vows are shackles that embitter. For I am a lucky man, favored by good fortune's hand, far more than I'm deserving. Mm. Oh, there's some great verses here. This is a really great verse. I know it's great. I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. There's some that die for want of work, others killed while seeking freedom. But I have more of what they need than ever I'll be needing. For I am a lucky man, favoured by good fortune's hand. Far more than I'm deserving. There were a couple more verses. But... Very good. Yes. Hooray for David Jones.